Hi there, Peter here at Onshore Cellars. I'm the resident wine guy here. We're gonna give you some hacks. We're gonna give you some life hacks, not just for the yacht, just for life. How can you open things in a slightly over the top, kind of me way? So what we're gonna teach you today is how to knife, sobrage a bottle really quickly, hopefully. Let's see if this works. Right, do we do this with a warm bottle or a cold bottle? You need to have a cold bottle every single time. Why does it have to be a cold bottle? Because when we remove all this crap, as soon as I take that cage off, any bottle of champagne or any bottle of Prosecco or any bottle of bubbles, if it's warm, the cork will fly. Okay. Hmm. Et voilà. Because it's cold, all of the carbon dioxide that's in the bottle is going crazy. It's kind of nicely chilled. Don't worry about an area, you're not gonna get hit. It's all good. <laughs> So what we're, what we're searching for is there is a line. It's a perfect crease going along here, okay? There is a line in the bottle. You'll track it down, you'll find it. That's what we're searching for. When we find that line, we take a pair of scissors. We take, I don't know, uh, I've used a mobile phone, not my own, obviously. You can use anything. Here, I'm using the classic cheese knife because uh, that's what we had to hand, right? So the idea is you find that crease, you hit the crease, and you go one, two, three, and you pray to God that it works. One, two, three. One, two, three. Woo! <laughs> voila. The technique would actually have been to put that glass in my other hand, but instead I did it this way around. Hey ho, let's drink really weirdly. Cheers. <laughs> Super clean. See how clean that cut is? That's that. That's that. I mean, I'm gonna die if I drink like that. So, nice and clean, nice and cool. It's just slick. 